Hey guys, I am here to show you the no-no. I just got it this week and I'm going to have to make a few videos down the road um, showing how the results are, are, you know, after weeks of usage. But anyways, so this is the, the case that I have for it. Came with the brush to clean it with. Get this nice little DVD um, instructions. And it came with two Thermacon tips. You have a large one and there is a small one. Um, let's see, the buffing pad and there is the lotion. Um, anyways, so I have been working on my arm for about a week using the larger one. I have kind of fine, um, they're kind of white hairs and I really hate them because when I go like in the summertime when it's sunny and everything it's like these hairs they just illuminate like you can just see them and if I'm ever tan it's like the hair is she stands out and it's just it's really bothersome to me but I would never consider shaving my arms because that's I don't know it's just weird but um Anyway, so they always advise, this is the power level, so that's low, medium, high. They always advise starting on the lowest setting first, but I'm, I'm okay with it. So I put it on high. I have my Thermacon tip in. You want to make sure that it lines up. There's these two little holes. There's the two metal things. I should probably have it off when I put it back in. So I'm going to turn it back on. I have it on high. And you just glide it over your skin at a 90 degree angle and it does get a little warm but it is not painful at all just like they say and you don't want to hold it on one area too long because even though it is not painful it is a little warm and you can I guess make burns I have not made I have not burned myself with this yet but I have seen other reviews where people talk about it and if you do happen to burn yourself I guess it's so minor that, you know, you wouldn't even see it the next day. And, you know, I've been working on this arm for a while. Uh, let's see, about three or four times this, this week, I think, since I've gotten it. And so far, I am really enjoying it. It is kind of fun. It does take a while to use, like, just, I mean, shaving is faster, but... You know, there's so many hours that we sit in front of a computer or a TV or whatever. Even just riding around in the car if somebody else is driving you. I mean, you could just do this anytime. Like, it's not a big deal. You don't need water. You don't... whatever. And it does kind of smell a little bit. And it is essentially kind of burning the hair off. Um, so it, it does smell like burning hair just a little bit. It's not... Um, too bothersome to me um, and then once you're done you want to take your buffer pad and you want to buff the hair that you or the area that you've just worked on and then you want to put the lotion on Okay, well, I seem to have misplaced my lotion. Um, probably got picked up by my daughter and this could be anywhere in my home. So anyways, I'm just going to, you know, actually I wanna show you guys, I've been working on this arm all week and this arm I have left as it usually is. Um, so I wanna make sure to show you guys the difference. So hopefully you can see that. There's no hair. It's actually really soft, really smooth. And there's my other arm. I guess I, it's a good thing that I don't have such dark hair. And it's, it's pretty fine as well, but I, I just don't like it. But, um... I am going to, you see this arm before, 
I'm going to no-no this arm and then show you after. Definitely smell the hair. And it is a lot stronger of a burning smell the more hair you have. So obviously like my first time using this on this arm, it's going to be a lot stronger and kind of somewhat bothersome to my sense of smell. But um, once when I do this arm, there's hardly any hair so it really doesn't smell that bad at all. I just gotta clean this up. There's a lot of hair in there. And it definitely says you should go against the direction of the hair. I'm just gonna go, I just kinda try and go in like all different directions just to make sure that I get it. This arm is almost done. There is like, I have not experienced any irritation whatsoever since I've been using it. Should clean it up a lot, a little bit. You always wanna make sure to use it on clean skin, just so you get the best results. And I have not yet used this on my legs, so I will be testing that out. I've seen other reviews where people are saying that you know, for coarser hair, it doesn't work as well. Um, you know, and I actually uh, used this on my husband's foot, which are pretty dark, thick, coarse hairs. And it actually worked all right. Um, I don't think my leg hair is too, like, too crazy. I lost my buffer. Here it is. So I think it should be just fine on my legs. Buff it out. And I still have some, so I'm going to keep going. Like I said, it's not like the quickest of procedures, but I mean, if it, over time, it can uh, slow the growth of your hair and make it come in finer then it definitely would be worth it. And you know, it's almost like mindless. You can do this anytime. I mean, how many hours a week or even every day do some people sit there and just watch TV? Now for me, I take pretty long showers just mostly because shaving takes such a long time. And if I don't have to worry about shaving anymore, like, I mean, that'll be saving on water, saving on electricity, saving time. I'll be able to get ready to go places a lot faster um, than being in there for like 30 minutes or 20 minutes. I mean, I could be in and out in like 10. So that would be a really good thing. So I've just finished buffing my arm and using the no-no. And I just want to show you guys I mean, it is really smooth, it's really soft, and I like it. It looks a lot better to me. Those hairs aren't bothering me because there is no hair. So, and, so anyways, you saw my arm before, you saw it after. And so now I have not shaven for, let's see, about three days on my legs. So I just want to test it on my legs. Now. The hair down here is a little bit more thick and stubbly than say like the hair up here is more like my arm hair where it's very fine. So I know it's going to work up here really well. And uh, so let's see if we can get a zoom in shot of my leg before. This is a lot easier to go against the grain of hair.
Okay, I'm gonna buff. I only did part of it. I don't want to make this video too long. Okay. And so I only did about this section right here. And I'm just going to... And this is the part where I didn't do. And hopefully you can tell. I mean, it is really... It is smooth right here. You cannot really see the hair. And then this is the side that is still has the hair. And it's very stubbly. So, I mean, this is after, this is my first treatment on this leg, my first treatment on this arm. I've been doing this arm for about a week. So I'm probably gonna make about a weekly video just updating my results and letting you guys know because it says over time, you know, it's going to grow in finer and less noticeable and and it'll slow the growth so we'll just update this every single week and i will show you my results so stay tuned next week oh and if you like this video be sure to subscribe to my youtube channel i have so many other product reviews if you have a product that you've been thinking about and wondering about i may already have a video for it and if I don't, I might have a written review on my website, which is confessionsofaninfomercialjunkie.com. There's going to be a link below that you guys can check it out. My written reviews are a lot more extensive. Um, you'll get to learn a lot about me just by reading them because, you know, I don't call it confessions for no reason. So, anyways, subscribe to my channel. I hope you enjoy it. Send me a message if if there is something that you're curious about and, and there's a contact me uh, page on my website. So, and I love getting messages and I answer almost all of them. So, as, as much as I keep up with them. So, thank you very much.